Welcome back to Stardew Valley. I am your host, longtime listener. Be sure to drop a like, hit that subscribe button, and comment below. Uh, fair warning, I actually uninstalled the recording application that I use for capturing all of the uh, content and audio and commentary and such, and reinstalled it, hoping that kind of starting from scratch and putting in uh, all of the inputs for you know the microphone, capturing in-game audio, et cetera, will help because for whatever reason, it would occasionally just basically stop capturing in-game audio. And I don't understand why. Now, the good news is when I did this, it eliminated the echo in my headset. So whatever that's about, because I, I know like, you know, a season ago or maybe even longer, I had mentioned that I started getting an echo for like just no reason. And I think what was happening was the game was cap capturing an audio or a input from like the laptop microphone. And so it would just shut it off. But when it was doing that, it was also turning off the in-game audio. So it was, you weren't hearing anything. So basically I went in, tested it, uh, actually posted a seven second video to YouTube just to then also watch it. And I was able to hear the in-game audio and myself. So, we'll see if this works. Um, I sure hope so, because I'm tired of having those issues. Anyway, episode 123, um, the trivia question from last time was, what year was the World Trade Center in New York City bombed? The answer to that question is 1993. Um, the trivia question for this episode is, in what state is Grand Teton National Park? Uh, is it true or not from last time was that Shakespeare's parents were illiterate? And the answer to that is that it is likely true. It's pretty clear that his mother was illiter illiterate because women back then weren't allowed to really be educated. Uh, but it's also believed that his father was illiterate because he would sign his name as an X, which usually was an indication that that person could not read or write or spell or whatever. So that is an interesting tidbit that Shakespeare's parents were likely illiterate. Um, the is it true or not for this episode is that an adult's blood vessels, if laid out end to end like you disassembled a human body took all the blood vessels and then laid them end to end they would circle the equator four times <clears throat> so there you go all right let's get going and i'll kind of talk about what's on the agenda as we go it's tuesday the 9th nothing on the calendar today um it is raining here and I believe it's sunny on the island, so I'm not sure how relevant that is. It's a very good luck day. That's not going to matter, though, because we have a bunch of stuff that we need to do around the homestead area. Um, so that's just that's what it is. I'm not used to Cooper being inside. I haven't seen him in there for a while. All right, she's going to work. Um, oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. Keep forgetting something. Wait for it. Let's go to hats. And let's go with a squire's helmet. And that's what she's going to wear. <laughs> Look at her. Oh, yeah. All right. We can check that off of the list. All right. So, oh, my gosh. Uh, let's check the computer. Sandy Shores, we're running a little bit low on hay, but hay day is coming up on Thursday, so we'll, we'll be fine. Um, nothing else there critical, I guess. I'm not even sure how much we'll make from the cauliflower that we planted, but honestly, wait. I want you to go... Whatever. All right, so uh, let's just bring that. Uh, anyway, our money situation is fine. I don't even know why I'm worried about how much we're going to make from 
cauliflower. I do need to remember to buy a crap load of um, what's it called? Star fruit. Because we need to get a bunch of that ready to replant on the island. Um, so whatever. Not a big deal. Alright, so... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... All right, anything else need to go back in there? I don't think so. Oh, I forgot about these dragon boots. I should have put them in the dresser while I was in there. I haven't played... I didn't get to play all weekend. That's becoming a theme. Um, is that, unfortunately, we're working on some home reno projects. Um, namely, we bought... We got a big... Uh, dresser chest like what was it called um, a big thing that you would like back in the day would have put a TV in a console or whatever but that also has like you know cabinets and such around it somebody was basically giving it away in our neighborhood so we went and picked it up and we're going to use it we have a crafty room for our kids where they can like what in the world my computer just froze they can go in there and like why is my computer freezing up on me? Um, oh, is it because it's raining? But anyway, um, they can go into the crafty room and like it's free rain. Like make a mess in there if you want to. It's basically like an art room at an elementary school. Like it's just kind of a given that it's going to get destroyed. Uh, wait, no, no, no. Wait, I did need to go in there. Because I need blobfish row. We're close to having enough sturgeon row that it surpasses my availability on the others. And I can do a big batch of caviar. I don't know that caviar is worth a whole lot more than lava eel row. Or worth any more period. I, mean, I know lava eel sells for a pretty good chunk of change. So... Uh, but anyway, in the crafty room, we got that thing. So we, you know, it needed some TLC. Can I get around here and get this? Sure can. I saw that in my overhead screenshot the other day. Hey, little buddy. How are you? So I need a, a mate for him. I should put a chest in there that has, I'm pretty sure I have another slime egg somewhere. Like the green one, that I think, that the wizard gave me whenever he... Uh, visited as soon as we got the um, what's it called <sighs> as soon as the slime hutch was ready he came and visited and I'm pretty sure he gave me a green slime egg it's like a starter egg because I guess maybe they're thinking that you haven't collected a slime egg by that point but anyway I need to get another one in there so that they can start breeding. Not that that's a huge deal. The slime hutch is very low on my list of priorities. Eventually what will happen is we'll have a bunch in there. We can go in and collect slime from them. We'll get some slime eggs that we'll sell. We will get... Um, I don't really know why I'm coming in here, but I guess we're just coming in to say hello to these guys. Oh, I need to plant some grass starter in here. Did it rain yesterday, too? And that's why not only are there no pigs out here because it's raining today, but there are no truffles out here because I guess maybe it rained yesterday, too. I Man, it's been a while since I played. But anyway, we, we had to do some uh, you know work fixing up that big cabinet thing uh and then we're getting ready to put in some carpet new carpet upstairs in the household so we're i mean if you're a homeowner and have kids home ownership is a non-stop effort like you're always tr trying to just keep up <laughs> so so 
uh, my weekends lately have been mostly reserved for getting the house taken care of. Unfortunately, is what it comes down to. Could probably sell that seaweed, but whatever, it's not a big deal. All right, so I'm hoping that my tree farm starts to come along because eventually we were we're hoping that we get. Um, oh my gosh, get on there! We're hoping that we get a what's it called um mushroom tree all right let's go ahead and swing back up here now let's put this in here that in there you come with me you go in there I need some grass starter. Let's do that. Spread it out a little bit and hopefully that gets our grass empire going again. Um, anyway, actually, you know what? Let's get a little bit more. So grass starter. Okay. Uh, you know what? Is my, uh, catalog still at the island from when I did some decorations? Pretty sure it is. Um. Now, okay, so let's go ahead and come in here. Can I pick this up without destroying it? Of course not. So I need three pieces of fence post. I guess. We're going to put one in front of each door. But first, we're going to... I know that that's not a, a lot there. To where it'll still take a while to regrow. Um, in fact, it won't even regrow fast enough because they'll be eating it as time goes. But it's not a big deal. We're just kind of trying to spread this out a little bit. Oh, I thought I was about to... <laughs> knock out the grass starter that I just planted. Man, I wish I had that horse flute right now. I actually kind of regret getting the key to the town first and not just saving up. Where did I leave Seabiscuit? Where is he? There he is. All right. Everything's done around the farm. We need to do a leak sweep, and then today we are going to... Um, try and get down to sit. There's another leak. How many is that? Eight out of 12. So we're getting there. Um, anyway, I do want to try and get down to cinder sap and clean it up. It's going to take a while, but whenever we're done, we can then head to the island and then tomorrow, in terms of objectives on the island, I think we're basically going to just try and go to the mine, to the volcano and get, um, actually you're going to stop in here. Oh, What is, I don't remember this cutscene, but Harvey working out with the ladies. Are you breaking a sweat? <laughs> yes, <laughs> says Harvey. 
Harvey can't hang with the latest. And he immediately just like magically doesn't have on his headband or the dumbbells he was holding. Evan, you were watching me? Actually, no, I was kind of around the corner. Hey, there's nothing wrong with staying in shape. Yeah, that's cool. I won't tell. It's all good, dude. I don't necessarily consider myself much of a gym rat, but um, before the pandemic, I was working out a couple times a week. Me and a buddy at work kind of held each other accountable. Can I get a calendar from you? I cannot. Dang it. That's from Robin that I need to get it, which I can't do today because it's Tuesday. Whatever. Not a big deal. Uh, why don't we go ahead and... Linus wants a green bean. That probably won't happen, Linus. It would be cool. Somebody actually said this on uh, Facebook. It would be cool if, like, after a while, the help wanted ads, your prize would, would sometimes be an item instead of cash. You know, like, oh, hey, Linus wants a green bean. And as a reward, he's going to give you sashimi or whatever. All right, why am I in here? Just dropping that stuff off, I guess. It's 3.30. Dang it. Ooh, 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 wait. Vincent's birthday is tomorrow, and he likes grape. So I'm going to go ahead and just bring it with me so I don't have to come back here to get it. Uh-huh. All right, so we're heading to... Cinder sap. I think we can get it all cleaned up today, but I mean, it's four o'clock already, y'all, and this is a big space. So this probably won't get completed. I mean, and we're in sand, quicksand again. Um, did I do, oh yeah, I did the, is it true or not? Oh, I haven't checked the, uh, whoops, went the wrong way there. I haven't checked the, what's it called? Secret Woods in a while. But there's not a whole lot there that I need to be looking for, so it's kind of like, what's the, what's the point in checking it? Ooh, hardwood? Like, I don't have enough of it already? I'm not sure I'll ever be able to use all of the hardwood that I have. Like, if I was going to make a bunch of uh, hardwood fence, maybe, but I don't plan on doing that. You know, like I used to put fence around my fields, but I don't anymore because I realize like it's pointless. I mean, it's just there for aesthetics. I thought you kind of needed it to keep wolves out just because it probably because of what people said on Facebook. You know, I, I used to get on there and just kind of, I, would, I wouldn't typically ask questions. I would just kind of sit and watch for other people asking questions and see what the answers were. Because a lot of times you could use the search tool or the search option in the, um, on the page to just look for a topic or whatever. And hopefully find what you were looking for. But anyway, I used to go on there fairly frequently. Or on even even just like looking up videos on YouTube. And people would be posting guides on YouTube. With information that I would eventually come to learn is completely wrong. <laughs> Which is like it's fine. I mean I get it that 
to an extent, it's like hard to understand the exact mechanics of this game early on as far as how everything works. Fences and stuff. You're kind of trying to typically pull your past experiences from games like Harvest Moon and kind of making assumptions, but those assumptions don't always prove to be true. And that's what would happen. Hey, Spring Onions. I haven't seen you in a while. Uh, somebody pointed out that I will eventually... Man, it is 8.20. we got to get going. I will eventually need to fish down beyond the um, sewer down there. Like, cast into the water. But to reach the water, I actually need um, a fish buffer that... Like, you need to get, like, plus five fishing skill, which will require the chi seasoning or whatever that increases your quality of your food. So I need to get something that has a fish buffer and then eat, you, you know, use the chi seasoning on it, I guess, to make it higher quality so that I get a higher buffer. Oh, did we just... Did we not check the... I guess I can leave the grapes in there, too. Um, did we not check this yesterday? Tropical fishing. Okay, I can do that, I guess. That's probably a good idea, because that might get me a couple of walnuts. Oh, crap. It's asking for specific ones. So I need to look up. I know the lionfish I can catch right from the dock. The stingray is in Pirate's Cove. Cutscene. The stingray is in Pirate's Cove. And then I want to say that um, the blue discus was... Cripes, where was it? In the river by the dig site, maybe? Surprised to find you out here in the rain. Rain, snow, sleet, or hail, you can never stop Evan. Isn't that how the saying goes? Look at the dark clouds looming over the horizon, says Sebastian. I hope they come this way. What? You want the rain? Makes everyone disappear. So, he's clearly an introvert who is not very social. But he's comfortable around me. That's cool. I mean, why wouldn't you be comfortable in, around a guy wearing mermaid boots, a skull t-shirt, and a deluxe pirate hat? He puts that out, and it's just dripping the rain right down on me. Oh. I... <laughs> Get in there, dude. Don't be shy. Cool. I I feel like I've oops. I've seen I've seen that cutscene. It's just been a while. All right. We got to get to the island. I was going to go to the mines tomorrow, but that plan has changed. Now, since I have the key to the town, I can get in here late at night from now on and I'll be like, "Willie, wake up. Take me to the island." Come sail away. Come sail away, come sail away with me. <sighs> yeah. Let's get it. All right, so I got to look up some of the fishes. But let's just go ahead and fish here. Until, you know, midnight or so. It's going to be a long episode, but whatever. I spent like 20 minutes describing my challenges that I've been having with audio. Oh, stay still, you brat. I almost lost him, but we're going to get him. And I bet this is a lionfish. Oh, no, super cucumber. I had a... Man, I had a trap bobber on and still almost lost him. Must be off of my fishing game. 
You know what would have been cool? Oh, there's a walnut. We got seven. A cool addition to the settings would have been the ability to edit fishing difficulty. Um, to where, like, okay, there's a lot of people that really struggle with fishing. So just make it easier for the people who want it to be easier. They can say, all right, you know, give me the simple fishing mechanics or whatevs. Where it could even just eliminate. There's another walnut. That might be the last. Well, well, that might be the last of the walnuts that we can fish out of the water. I'm not sure though. I really want a lionfish. We're gonna have to really focus on this mission because it's already. You know, we started on Tuesday instead of Monday. Holy crap! Stay still. Are we going to get another? Is this another super cucumber? I don't remember lionfish being that difficult. Now, what is the deal? <sighs> I don't want super cucumbers. I mean, they sell for a pretty penny or whatever, but I don't need them. I need lionfish, dang it. This might be another one. We might never know because we might not catch it. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? Last cast. We're going to fail this mission at this rate. Yep, I think that's another one. We've got the treasure chest. Another one. This is, It's broken. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Nobody hanging out at the... Uh, dude, I, that would be my spot right there come to the island resort and there's a little tiki bar right there do i need any of this stuff we just ran out of our spe speed buffer yeah we don't have anything to harvest so head to bed now boom 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 and boom that stuff will all come back with me tomorrow in fact if I'm just going to go fishing tomorrow, uh, no, we're fine. I need, is the calendar in here? I could have sworn there was, you could get a calendar out of, maybe it's here. Or do I need to buy... There it is. I'm not crazy about... Okay, we can go there. Alright, let's go to bed. Man, that was a long day. <clears throat> 45 grand. What did we sell? Truffle oil... Lava eel. That's what it was. I was like, we shouldn't have made that much. I didn't have any truffles, but... Alright, um... So, like I said, we were going to go to the volcano, but I instead, I think what I'm going to do is simply... There's the island music. Sorry. All right, it's going to rain on the island tomorrow, so we got to get back to the island, which we'll probably come back anyway to try and get the fishing situation knocked out. But that is a, another good reason for me to make it out here. Good luck day. Queen of Sauce reruns. I think I've gotten all of the 
recipes that I can get from the Queen of Sauce. But anyway. All right, we got a little bit of cash back from Pierre. I will say, you know, Pierre gets a bad reputation because he's kind of a scoundrel. But at the same time, he gives us cash back when we <laughs> half the time, like, I don't spend any money with him and he still sends me a cash back rewards or whatever. All right, I don't think we need to harvest anything from there. Let's go check for mussels and then we'll go fishing. Uh, are you serious? I feel like those have slowed down in terms of how often we're seeing them. But uh, it's not a big deal. All right, let's go ahead and actually just stuff those in here. Boom. And I want to go back down to the docks, I guess. Actually, you know what? Let's go to the dig site. I feel like... That's where one of those fishes was. Let's check that out. Oh, by the way, we hit... Wait for it. We hit... Oh, come on. 600 subscribers. Yay. All right. Um, okay, we're on the page here. It should be... Toward the bottom here. Okay. Ginger Island, Pond and Rivers. Pirate Cove, and then in the ocean. So Blue Discus, I should be able to catch up by the dig site. That's where I want to go. Because I think there's something else that we need to catch there. I do like the island music. Got the steel drum vibe going. Alright, no weeds out here in the dig site. That's cool. I don't really know why I'm doing this because my priority needs to be I should have brought the pan whatever all right let's uh I guess just kind of go like this doesn't really matter water's not very wide but I should be able to catch blue discus and hopefully not trash Hopefully, we can also catch, um, there's like a skeletal bone for the, the museum, the Professor Snail. One of the things that he wants, supposedly, you fish up in here. All right, there's one blue discus. We need five. Hello, parrots. Ooh, journal scrap. <gasps> There's a walnut right there by the volcano. Good to know. In fact, I might have other journal scraps for the island that I haven't addressed. So we'll have to keep an eye on that situation. All right, this will be another blue discus. That'll give me two. I would like to get at least one of the types of fish done today. Um, I do need to get back and give Vincent his gift and do a leak sweep. Then tomorrow is Ancient Fruit Day. This will be number three on the blue discus count. And some treasure. Oh no, a tilapia. Dang it. I don't want tilapia. Dinosaur egg. That's cool. Uh, but anyway, tomorrow is Ancient Fruit Day, so it's going to be a busy day. I don't want to pay attention. Um, <clears throat> it'll be a busy day on the island. Or on the mainland. Come on. Come on with the trash. I want to... I want to get my five blue discus, head to the volcano... <clears throat> and grab that walnut that it was pointing out in that journal scrap and then go and then tomorrow we'll do the stuff on the mainland come on uh oh let's try that and see if we can get 
two blue discuses. <sighs> Not glasses. Come on. All right, here we go. Here we go. Be the one. Be the blue discus. Not a tilapia. Yes, does that count as two? It sure does. We only need one more. We'll use the double bait. It's fine. <clears throat> the wild bait. We catch two more. It's just one for the collection. And of course, there's the stuff that I could have panned. I think this is the blue discus. Um, I don't know. Might be a tilapia. Okay. All right, so we got those five. All we have to do is catch them. We get to keep them, so that's cool. And it's only 10.30, so let's go here. Go to the volcano. I didn't look up Vincent's schedule, but it's a weekday, and he's a child, so he should be at school. So it's going to be like right there. I need to dig, right? Boom. Ooh! Ooh! Ah! We got an ostrich egg. Okay, I believe you need a special incubator for it, but at least we got the egg. It may be the world's largest egg. While we're here, let's go collections. All right, journal scraps. Okay, found myself stranded now, blah, blah, blah. At any rate, no choice. Okay, we're cool with that one. Waters are edible fish. Caught a stingray in the caves. Golden fished up some golden walnuts. They're all over the island, and the parrots love them. Golden nuts. Keep eyes peeled for subtle clues. If something looks unusual, there may be a hidden nut nearby. Signs in the sand and signs in the leaves. Not. Oh, saw a nut up in a tree. If only I have a way of shooting it. Okay, we got that one. I think we got that one. Glowing eyes, skittering in the dark like cats in the night. Dwarf men? <clears throat> Strange machines, too. All right. We, we got that one. Forging table. We know that. Weapon enchantments. We're good there. Twas a rain-drenched day. It was a clear black night. Sorry. On a rainy day... I don't need, on a lonely rock, a beautiful maiden saw I. Okay. If this harried sea dog a tune could howl, perhaps black gold treasure. Something. Is there more to that scrap? She would lead. Okay. So, uh, cripes. That one is one that we'll need to do. And so that one's it. So we only have one left. Anyway, um, what does that mean in terms of our plans tomorrow? We need to get back here. Uh, why am I going on foot? all the way down here and then i'm gonna have to hang a left here go to the farm grab my stuff and then head back to the docks get back to the island or get back to the mainland and do the stuff we need to do there so what can stay here uh, i don't think any of that stuff really needs to stay here does it all right let's uh let's go yeah hey gus how about a beer pal oh i could get a pina colada gimme mango wine we're getting a recipe for tropical curry so that's one of the three remaining recipes that i think we still needed i'm drinking that pina colada 
Yeah. It's gonna make me drunk. Oh, no, it didn't. It just gave me energy. I guess it was a uh, virgin pina colada. I like rum in my pina coladas. All right, so it's going to rain tomorrow. We got to get back to the island and look for the um, mermaid. Per that last journal scrap that we were reading about there. We also need to try and find the gem bird. And hopefully it's the one up by the volcano. Is it the one by the volcano that I need? I think so. Right? Let's head over here and grab this stuff, I suppose. Oh, no. This is a problem. Trash. Be gone. Uh, cripes. Joja Cola. Be gone. Mixed seeds I don't care about. Is there anything else that I'm cool throwing away? Rice shoots. This, not, this amphibian fossil can go. I don't care about it. Actually, this fossilized leg. Be gone. Take that oyster instead. And see, I got two of them. <clears throat> That's the value of the gatherer perk or whatever it's called. Gatherer and botanist. I, If I never saw a mixed seed again in my life, I'd be totally fine with that. All right. Let's come here. Go like that. And now you come with me. Um, also, I guess maybe you come with me and I'm going to leave one spot. Actually, let's bring wood too while we're at it. No, 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 no. I don't need the wood. Actually, let's leave like, yeah, let's leave that stuff there. Grab the wood, grab the spring onions, All right? Why not? Oh, bone fragments need to go back to the island. So... Dandelion coming to me. Now, let's look up um, Vincent's schedule, just so we're not hunting around for him. <clears throat> My internet is atrociously slow. <clears throat> Spring 10. It's a Wednesday. Right? All right, he's at the museum. Let's go. It's kind of where I thought he would be. <clears throat> I need to go back to that walnut room and look for another chi quest or whatever they're called. Why am I going to Clint's? Okay. Hello. 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 Hey, this is great. Wait, do I have all of the... Um... <gasps> I don't have this one yet. I think we can go get that cutscene, right? Meow. <clears throat> Let's go like this, though. Go to the bus stop. I don't see any leaks. It's only 2 o'clock, so we got time here, but I need to do something critical. <clears throat> Look at all the look at the chickens like glitching out there. No. Let me in. All right. <clears throat> Boom. Boom. Whoa, that was nice. All right, so green onions or I always call them green onions. Spring onions. Go like that. Uh chanterelles. We can swap out in exchange for Iridium quality. I don't necessarily know that I like that, though. So, you stay in there for now. Until I have enough to, like, cook recipes and stuff. And have some left over. I don't want to have just one. So, alright. Now, I guess like that. And that. And that. And that. Ostrich egg. 
Uh, where am I keeping eggs? In here. You go in there. Uh, dino egg. You stay with me. So, let's see here. Sell. Blue discus. I need a place for you. Do I not have any blue discus already? Okay. Let's keep... Three. So, sell. Oh my gosh. Sell. Put away. Sell. Do I not have a starfish saved somewhere? Here we go. All right. <clears throat> Holy moly. I feel like there was something that I meant to do when I got back to the farm here, and now that took so long that I forgot what it was. So that's kind of a bummer. What would it have been? Um, oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> Before I forget. We want to come down here. Man, where's my row, yo? I think this is going to kick off. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh, y'all. It's amazing how quickly I tend to notice that now. Here we go. So this is a cutscene that is going to give us the last thing for our wallet, which is good timing because I'm actually going to be selling some spring onions today, and that's going to make me like an extra seven gold. Spring onion. Mom sends me out to pick these sometimes. How come his is dancing? Jazz doesn't like them. They're too spicy for her. <clears throat> So Vincent's going to show me a secret, and it's basically pull the spring onion out and then clean it. And it makes it better. Wouldn't you know it? So you peel it just a little bit, and it gets the bugs out. <gasps> Ooh, bugs. Cool, huh? What do you do with the bugs? Uh, squash them. <laughs> She's like horrified. Jazz is like, I didn't hear that. I didn't hear it. I didn't hear anything about the bugs. Just leave the bugs alone and it's all good. And Vincent's pacing in circles like, what did I just do? All right, there we go. They're now worth five times what they were before. Not, like, uber exciting. No, Seabiscuit, come with me. All right. But anyway, that's that. I guess since we're down here, we'll go ahead and grab this one row. We're going to have some truffles today. That's cool. We also have some... Uh... Maple syrup and pine tar, or oak resin, huh? All right, we'll go in here, I guess. Lots of stuff to collect in here. I like it. J Man, rubies take forever. I gotta say, that's the downside. I think it's because of their value, like dollar-wise. The more they sell for, the longer they take to produce. If only... There was, like, a way for me to say, but I'm not doing this to sell them. So can I have them faster, please? <laughs> but it's not a big deal. We don't need that much uh, in terms of rubies. Uh, nothing going on. There. Did I, I got the fruit yesterday, so there's nothing going on in there that I need to deal with. But let's come up here. We forgot to do this. All right, now we'll just do that. Now, what are we selling here? Sap can be sold. I think I decided that I might keep the maple syrup for a beehive empire at some point, but I can't remember, so we'll go look at that. And I don't remember if I need a shrimp. I probably don't, but we'll make sure. So, we 
We are not keeping that for a beehive empire. We're keeping that in case we do another keg empire. That's what it was. Boom. Uh, boom. Did not need that. I didn't put that away when I should have. Uh, yeah, let's go. <clears throat> let's go take care of that real quick. So, sell. Wait. Sell you too. You go in there. Oh my goodness. So much stuff. Hat. Go in there. Look at our, look at little sweet Melody running around with her knight's helmet on. Squire's helmet, I believe it's called. Ooh, uh, let's go up and do a leak sweep real quick. <clears throat> See if we can find one mo. Cut into that. How many do we need? Four more, I think. Got a couple of weeks to find them, but... Time will run short quickly with that quest. I'm actually surprised how many I've seen so far to where I almost wonder if they make them a little bit more common whenever you accept that quest. But whatever. <clears throat> I think there are three special orders that I still need to complete. Uh, this being one of them. Okay. Okay. And now this would be the, you know, two out of three. So we're cutting into those pretty, pretty good. You know what I just noticed? That's pretty cool. Uh, there's a little like trapdoor looking thing on top of the slime hutch. What purpose does that serve? You know. All right, we're gonna save the iridium dinosaur egg not sure why i will never use it for anything but i want to have at least five of them i guess we'll go for all right all right um so this was a busy episode, y'all. I mean, we're not done yet. Oh, man. They're all trying to sleep all of a sudden. Just missed the ability to pet them. We got some truffles again today. That's cool. There should be, like, close to 40. Um, assuming all of my pigs dug up... Oh, my gosh. I don't... Uh, I'm not trying to... See, how come it let me love on that one, but then, like, all Zocker's trying to sleep? I don't get it. I thought they all went to sleep at the same time. All right, we're going to just leave Seabiscuit there. So keeping the grass like that will basically make it to where each day the pigs will have a little bit of grass that they can eat instead of having to eat um, from the silo. So that's cool. It's that volcano music, y'all. I really wish it would keep playing even after you left and went outside. But whatever. Okay. Ooh. So I think I mentioned this recently. Actually, in fact, I know I mentioned this recently because then somebody commented about it. If, whenever I complete this playthrough, I still have the motivation to perhaps do another playthrough, um, I don't know if I need that duck egg or not, but we'll bring it back just in case if i have the motivation to not to do another playthrough we'll do one and we will do a jojo mart route playthrough 
which will be really hard for me because I've never done it and I don't know like strategy wise what I need to try and focus on. Um, I think it's basically just all about making money. Like you don't need to worry so much about collecting certain items. We'll still try and have a balance of a lot of different stuff, but the objective will be just make a whole bunch of money. And what it actually might do is so if I don't have to worry about like, I got to hurry up and try and get the, the barn so that I can get a pig so I can get a truffle before the end of uh, fall. I can spend more time socializing and befriending people because you kind of need to do that anyway if you go to the Jojo Mart route. Look, we got cloth from uh, putting paper in there. That's cool. Not that I really care that much because I don't necessarily need cloth or whatever. But in fact, should we do a tailoring day? Tomorrow is not a good day for it because we need to get to the island. In fact, I should probably try and get to the island now. No, because it's it's ancient fruit day tomorrow. So that's going to be our focus. We get up in the morning, have to knock out all the stuff around the farm, and then get to the island. Uh, check the computer. Machines ready. Eight. What is that? Whatever. Uh, that's going to do it for this episode. So if you have not done so already, please be sure to hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Comment below and we will see you all next time.